shit. He... Look at that fucking damage. He used his fucking Q or whatever. His Q did like 800 damage to him. What the fuck? The Holy shit, he threw shot. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was ridiculous. Play Twitch, apparently he's OP. Nah, I'll try out that stupid ass build that you guys keep asking. Cause people are asking the ghost blade. I don't actually know if this is like a Korean build or if you guys are just trolling the fuck out of me telling me to go this terrible ass build. So I'm gonna actually look it up first. Except I can't read Korean, so one sec. Don't do it, it's a trap. Oh, I know it's a fucking trap. Fuck, I don't know who's an AD in Korea. I'm just gonna have to start clicking on. Okay, SKT1 bang. I'm pretty sure this guy's an AD, man. Okay, does he have any? He has a Lucian game. Okay. Fuck you, I'm not going that garbage ass Lucian build. <laughs> meta slave? Dude, it's not even about being a meta slave. Come on. Indeed. Uh, I'll fuck it. I'll try choice. it out, man. Why not? Just because I hate building, uh, whatever the item's called. I hate Essence Reaver, so. I mean, if you give me another build, man, sure, why not? Let's go for it. Oh, he ate both of them. That was unlucky. Holy shit, did that guy actually fucking live? Holy moly, dude. Wow, that was fucking unlucky right there. That was a truly unlucky experience. That was pretty good. Getting the tower dive off and me surviving. Can't go wrong with that one. I think I'm going to buy the armor pen here. I want to just really just put it in, you know. I need some of that penetration. If the game looks like it's going to be close, I'm just going to build a ghost blade and then go regular items. But if it's looking like it's going to be a slaughter, I'll fucking build the entire thing. Because the thing is, black cleaver is... It's kind of worthless against not tanks, and there's no tanks in this game, so it's kind of worthless. I'm taking down a Korean challenger, boys. Woo! We're doing it! Woo! All right. Yeah. Woo. I'm probably just gonna dive this guy. He's the Korean challenger. Liquid and Nori, dude. He hit challenger in Korea. And if that if I beat him today, that means that I'm a challenger Korean player. Flawless logic. Pretty sure that's how it works, dude. Holy fucking moly, dude. What the fuck? Oh, he got the kill on him. Nice, I got the assist on that too. Oh well, having a uh, ghost blade versus Sivir is really good because it's hard for her to not just take a bunch of damage from me since she's so low range. Uh, I have a lot of kill pressure on her with ghost blade, so we'll see what she does. Fuck! Yeah, I didn't hit my fucking heal in time. Ugh, god damn it. If I had zero ping, dude, if I was in fucking Korea, I would have hit that heal.
Fuck, man. I knew he was fucking still there. Oh my god, dude. Alright, I'm a cutie pie running into Lucian. Does he take the fight? Oh, Raven ran into me. Damn, I'm cutting him out like a boss. Holy shit, he's all over the place. Ooh, dashes into melee range to secure the kill. What a beast. Alright, in this next clip, pretty sure I just killed this guy. Boom, he's fucking dead. Nice shit. Woo. Now I get the shop. Alright. Okay, is that it? I'm not sure how I feel about this build. I mean, it's really good if your verse is a really weak laner. So someone like Sivir, I mean, I already knew I'd roll the shit out of her because there's not much that Sivir can do already versus Lu like Lucian already counterpicked Sivir, so. Yeah, that's like Sivir's biggest problem is she's a very weak laner, so almost everything will beat Sivir in lane. So, like, Yomu's is a really good item on Lucian or on any ADC if you think you can bully out your lane. Because the armor pen just... ADs don't get armor, so it's always effective. The problem with it is that you fall off if you don't smash your lane. Ha ha ha. 